Hey guys, Ultra Bricks here. I'm going to show you how to make a transparent image. So, first go to your web browser and go to paint.net. This will be in the description. Now to download this, it's pretty hard. When you go to paint.net, you're going to go you just going to see this where it says paint.net. There'll be a link that says visit paint get paint.net. And and then get it now free download. Click on that, and then you'll go to um, you go to download it. So where I was, you when you click on download, you'll see this. It says download. If you would like to download, please use one of the download buttons below. Where it says download now, download now, not PDN, click on that. And if you download now on the top right, paint.net, and install it. Alright, so once you're done downloading that and installing it, uh, when you open it, it's going to look like this. It should look like this. And I'm just going to drag in a file, a picture of an iPod Touch. And now you have to watch this whole video because you have to do certain things. There's a lot of steps. Well, not a lot of steps. They're easy. So, so once you're done opening it and opening your image, you're going to see tools right here. You can exit it and you can open it. So when you go to tools, use magic wand, click on it, click on the white background or the background that you'd want to delete and make transparent. Just press the lead on your keyboard and it'll be transparent. If you want to, if there's any text that you don't want on it, go to tools and go to rectangle select. Select the, the thing, delete, and it's gone. And yeah, that's how you make a transparent image. Thank you for oh, I'll do another image after this. Then I'll I'll show you how to save it properly. So this time I'll do it with the back background, a black background, my bad. And magic wand. See if you have a black background, it's not gonna work that well. See how some of the hands cut off, and so I suggest you get one with the white background. And yeah, that's about it. Now I'm going to show you how to save it properly. I'm going to go to File, Save As, and where it says JPEG, click on that and go to PNG, Save, and put it to Auto uh, Detect. So 32 bit, 24 bit, I suggest Auto Detect. Um, if you put 8 bit, you can. Turn the quality up, I'm pretty sure. That's only with 8-bit, so thank you for watching. I'll show you the file after. And I'll open Sony Vegas. Just to show you that it is a transparent picture. So I'll go to my computer. Uh, let's see, which one did I use? This one, alright. So I'll drag in my transparent photo and it's transparent as you can see if I make the background a different color solid color red oh my bad So there you go. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, rate, and comment. Uh, don't forget to don't forget me to add you as friend. Add me as friend, and there'll be a I've a touch 32 gigabyte giveaway when I get a thousand subs, and there'll be a giveaway when I get 700 subs. So thank you for watching. Goodbye.